Love Sunday traffic here, don't we? Absolutely love it. So, guys, girls, welcome back. Uh, we're just nipping over to Barnsley today, so I thought I'd take you on the journey. And uh, I'm off to go look at buying a brand new car. I'm not test driving it today, I'm just going to go and have a look. But uh, if I like it, I might test drive it. And if I do test drive it, I'm going to video it and stick it on the channel. So had to wash the bike this morning because basically yesterday I pretty much did a little bit of off-roading I shouldn't have done but I did uh, it's not an off-road bike but we did it anyway and uh, the back wheel was so muddy it was horrible all the brakes were cluttered up with dust and stones anyway so big shout out to all my brand new subscribers as well uh, got like 50 new subscribers yesterday big shout out to you guys and uh, thank you for subscribing and uh, putting up with my videos and me talking shite while I'm riding around BMW crew Africa twin fuck this white car off turn left Yes, we shall. Forty mile an hour. That's what freedom smells like. Ah, oh, wind it in your face. G's of Wakefield. <coughs> Excuse me. Right, I'm not going down that middle reserve because last time I did that, I got a big dirty nail in my tyre, so no chance. If you're wondering why I'm not using my uh, quick shifter today as well, I'm back on the clutch. I had a little problem with my quick shifter recently, and uh, I'll get I'll get into that into another video. But basically, Kawasaki are having to deal with this bike now because there's something wrong with it. And uh, yeah, we're going to be using the clutch today. I don't fancy going through what I went through last time. In a nutshell, it snagged really hard and nearly threw me off bike. And there was a wagon coming the other way, so... <coughs> Let's go back to the old school. Run DMC. 
Uh, back to the clutch. Feels weird when you haven't used the clutch for a while and then you go back to it. Took me ages to get used to a quick shifter. Dembidale Viaduct No oh, behind me Don't pull out Give him a nod. All right, pal. I don't know if you nodded back or not. I didn't see that one. 50% nod back and sort of 50% dirt. I don't know, whatever. Sometimes you don't see it. Uh, so just to let you know, we're on the road to Barnsley now and uh, this road is quite a knackered old road so we're not going to be piping it round here. Let's take it instead, uh, let's take the scenery in. Let's not have any crashes. Ended up taking the S22Rs off this, the tyres that come with it. I've only done about 2,600 miles on this bike and the S22Rs had pretty much worn away. Could have been my tyre pressure that's done it. I was checking it, but you know, whether it were right or not, I don't know. Well, I've got the T38s, I think they're called now, and I tell you what, I actually prefer uh, riding. I certainly feel more confident on these T38s than I did on the uh, S22s. And I did love the S22s when I saw it. Oh, check this out. Yes, boy. We needed a picture next to that green car, green bike. We need to fuck this Clio off really, don't we? Because uh, ruining my video. Back to the national speed limit. Problem with these roads is that every corner is a blind corner. <laughs> Gotta be really careful. <laughs> Car coming.
think there's some speed cameras on here, but before we hit them, let's fuck this clear off. You don't even have to change gear, keep it in four, wind it back and feel the power. Power. Can and all. Not been there since I was a kid. as well yeah let's go past it God loves a trier <laughs> more in six That's what I'm currently driving at the moment, an old Festa like that. I just bought it for cash, just something to run me about in lockdown. And do you know what, I'm not going to lie, quite enjoy driving it around. It's just a shed, I don't care about it, if it breaks, whatever, who cares. Have a bit of fun, it's only 1.2, doesn't even go fast. You bet, the thing about having a smaller engine car is you can rag it around more. You know, if you start with a two litre and turbo and that, no way you can open them up. At least with the 1.2 you can uh, <laughs> rag them around like a little go-kart, you know. I know you shouldn't, it's illegal or whatever, but you know, you're going to have a bit of fun, aren't you? Do it in a safe environment, that's all it's about. So, we're in the middle of Barnsley, we're pretty much at the garage there and wanting to go. I, I looked online before I set off, they still had the car, I just hope for God's sake it's still there and uh, they just not took it off the website, well, we're stuck in traffic again now look, we're not going to cut through because uh, I'm pulling left in a minute, into second, oh no this is Ford side, so Trust Ford vans and we're actually going into Trust Ford cars, it's not a Ford though, well technically it is a Ford but it's not a Ford. Right, I'm going to drive around car park and I'm going to see if you can guess which car I'm going to look at. Another bit of turn in there pal. Right, okay, so the car is here, I can see it. I'm going to have a slow drive around, I'm going to see if you can see it. Lovely looking car there. Have you guessed it yet? I don't think you've seen it yet. I can see it. Oof, 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 oof. That lovely orange Mustang there, what do you think? Right, let's get parked up. Let's go back down and park up next to it. I just realised I've forgotten my face mask. Oh, 
Lovely looking and clean there now. Let's have a quick look at this Mustang. I'm not going to lie, we're looking for one in green. Green would have been the one to go for, wouldn't it? Check this baby out. Okay. Yeah, damn. Spoiler's got to come off. It's going to have to have a carbon GT spoiler on it. Yeah, that's what we're talking about. Yes! Alright, mate. How are you doing? Yeah, I've come to test drive your car today. Take it. <laughs> right, okay, guys, girls, for another video. Peace.